Today we're going to build a cantana. You basically start with five pieces of copper, a five by five and a five by three and a half, four times. You begin, this is a little jig I built, putting your piece down, selecting a piece, fit them up tight together. Quick clamp may provide the answer. Set it back up. Put your clamp in place. Tighten it up in there. Take your torch. Light flame. Solder. Simply heat the area. Let it seat into place. Hold it one time, tack it. Let it cool slightly. Copper is extremely hot. The first step, actually, or you can do it at any time before you solder the can up, you need to take your flat five by three and a half piece, put an arrow in the front. For your net gear adapter, you go from one side, two and five sixteenths. Draw a line from the other side, two and seven sixteenths, up this way, one and five sixteenths to draw this line, and one and seven eighths to draw this line. You need a drill hole for your tripod, exactly one inch. Now I use this from a template I already had, but it still holds true. Now. Take a block of wood that you can tear up, take your drill with a quarter inch bit, high speed, drill out your hole first. A couple of times. Now you want to drill in the center of the lines that you created. Same thing on the other side. Be careful not to go over your line. You can drill a little bit and combine these holes by wiggling the drill bit back and forth. Or you can take and file them out. Now I use a Dremel, but I have done this for years with a file. Dremel makes it faster. Put your safety goggles on. On one, I've used Netgear because they had such good reliability and they seem to work real well. You slide this in, make sure it fits. A little bit of slack, it doesn't, so we have to grind a little more until we get it fitting snug and flat. Once the box is constructed, you see all seams you should be uh, solder all seams, all four corners back everything there's your bottom piece where the adapter will fit now even the best most proficient solderers occasionally get a board out of position as you see right here boards are different position so your handy dandy hacksaw proves useful around on this side Take it, trim it up give it a little give it a little cut so you can smooth it up basically for your cover on the other side pretty well except for that one we got a little trim trim it off a little now go down each side with a hacksaw at an angle and hold it like this and you can trim off any rough edge it makes for a smooth finish you won't snag or cut yourself go down each one a little bit too much cut just take off an edge. Hold it still. Shut up. Take your file. File the edges down so it's nice and smooth. May have to work on it a little bit. Go around each side. Basically, you can go on the top. Smooth them down. This makes for a nice quality finish when you paint. 
Now, here's the other step I like to do to avoid corrosion. Take a piece of tape, tape over the tape over the whole bottom. Take your clear flat paint or gloss, doesn't matter, take your paint. Give it a nice blast inside the can. What that does is prevents corrosion where the copper turns green, give you years of service. After you have your can together, quick paint job around three sides. Take the tape off. Now next step is to put your tripod on. In the front hole, take a tripod, flexible, available on eBay, other places I guess, camera shops. Take a one quarter inch nut, one quarter by twenty. Put in a hole. Proceed to tighten it up. Try to take try to take the front part of the tripod, the leg that sticks out of the front, away from the clip, pocket clip. Hold it in position. Give it a firm snug with your pliers. Try not to let it move too much. There you go. Now you got the tripod. Bend your legs out to support the back. Might have to bend it a little bit and get it where you like it. And there you go. That's the basic. Go. Next step, Gorilla Glue white fast dry. Put your little water around the edge to activate it. Take your Gorilla Glue. Just drizzle you a bead out there. Pretty good. Don't be scared of it. All the way around. Around the outside edge. Get it like this. Go around the nut one time so you can unscrew it if ever need be. Put your little Gorilla Glue there. Go around the outside of the adapter with a bead. Very fast because it tends to drip around it. Make sure the light, the connectivity light, is facing you. Put it in there fast. Straighten it up. Because this one's got a little play in it. You straighten it up. Make sure it's straight. Make sure the can is level both left, right, front to back. www.wifi.cantana.com for more info and thanks for watching.